Okay, guys, so the location is North Carolina, specifically Western North Carolina. Now, this is actually going to be the area of the map that we're actually going to focus on. So um, we're planning on doing two major cities. So what we're going to do is we're going to do something similar to what Grand Theft Auto um, does and, and sort of... Um, copy a location but change the names of the locations obviously but we plan on making uh two cities so one major city which will be charlotte nor uh, north carolina and greensboro uh, north carolina which will be a slightly smaller city um and in between those cities will be actually rural towns uh so the main rural town will be uh, obviously uh hickory mooresville we might be able to do a few others but they, these ones are um are a couple of i've just selected to sort of give you an idea um there will be other rural towns like Asheville and Winston uh, Salem, uh, but that will be slightly uh, bigger rural towns, ones with bigger uh, downtown centres. And obviously, uh, the, we, we've got um, plans on making a forest because there is a forest in this location. There's another forest up here, so uh, we could also add that. But um, let's jump straight into the topography. Okay, so when you look at the topography, this is pretty much the area that we're, we're trying to do, which is, uh, you know, West North Carolina. So um, the idea is that uh, the main city map is going to be at the south of the map and uh, Greensboro, which is going to be to the to the north um, east side of the map, obviously. And then the little towns are sort of going to be in between, uh, sort of in the center of the map. Uh, but there will be sort of highways connecting the two cities and obviously um, all, all the um, rural towns. There is other rural towns that we could sort of, um, you know, add as well uh, to fill up the area. But there will be um, obviously a rainforest down here. Uh, we could add this rainforest also. But um, mainly, um, there's there's also going to be a lake. Uh, so we're, we're, we're going to um, try and um, mimic this lake here, Lake Norman it's called. But um, as you can see, it sort of transitions into, and turns into like a, a river. So this river goes all the way um, to hickory so it's going to go past hickory and i think it extends here yes it does uh extends all the way down here i believe down to to, to the national forest uh we're not even that far but uh yeah so the idea is that we're, we're going to try and uh mimic this whole area uh there is um mountain ranges i believe uh black mountain i don't know if that's an actual mountain but um, one of our developers is actually from North Carolina and he says there is sort of mountain ranges. So there will, will be mountain ranges as well. Uh, but that's the idea. So um, the idea is that 80% of the map is going to be rural towns, big open areas. Uh, and then there's just going to be like a major city and a small city, but sort of distance apart, uh, distance apart. And sort of, you know, right down the edge of the map is going to be like a massive forest sort of thing. So uh, the idea is that, um, you know, the major city is going to be um, uh, Charlotte, obviously. And uh, we're going to try and copy at least some of these buildings, uh, you know, put a stadium in the, in this uh, sort of same location make sure there's a uh, the highways actually going you know around in this location make sure there's a train track so that we are going to look at the city uh, similar to how Grand Theft Auto does and try and sort of um, you know uh, replicate our version of, of the city uh, so so the map size actually let, let me quickly jump straight into that so the map size uh, we're planning is going to be 64 square kilometers and the way it's going to be is that um, the landscape is sort of going to be like a big square 64 kilometer uh, landscape maybe even rectangle but the idea is that the outskirts of the map or the end of the map is going to be one massive mountain range so there's going to be one massive mountain range around the whole map sort of thing. It's not going to be an island like Grand Theft Auto. There isn't going to be an ocean. There's essentially going to be a, a mountain range barrier. Uh, we're doing that because we could uh, potentially extend the map, make the map bigger or add new locations. And we can easily, easily do that with a mountain range. We can just extend the mountain range to add more land mass to, to the map sort of thing but let me jump uh back over to here so obviously we've got the major city and then we've got a smaller city uh the the major town uh well the rural towns the sort of feel we're going for is more like a mooresville uh district uh this is from uh hickory a stadium from hickory so um this is all sort of uh good sort of rural factories and stuff like that um i don't know if it's considered rural in america that's what i'm just sort of calling it uh sub rural if you will um you know and obviously at Asheville, which is um 
this is going to be the major rural town obviously another ma major rural town here but the major rural towns are going to be slightly bigger with uh bigger downtown centers you know a couple of small skyscrapers and stuff like that and then obviously uh the forest this is from uh one of, one of the forests and uh we're sort of going to go you know find the right trees at that forest um you know all the locations are going to have all the right trees foliage we're really going to try and uh replicate this um this whole um, state, if you will, uh, or county, uh, as it, we're, we're, we're probably going to have to break it up into multiple counties. Uh, so there will, will be multiple counties. Say this is a county. We might even try and replicate the actual county grid uh, to work it out like that. But that's the actual plan. So um, that's where we are with the uh, with the map. So uh, we're really only in the planning stages right now. We've really only just chosen a location, planning out the biome and all that. Uh, working out what type of foliage we need and all that sort of stuff. Um, we're really not even going to try and make the map right now. We're really only in early stages. Um, uh, we've really only just released version 1, uh, 1.0. Uh, check the devlog uh, links on screen now um, or the links in the description. Um, but yeah, that's where we are pretty much. So we've actually chosen a location now. So if you're actually from uh, North Carolina and you've got... Um, maybe you can uh let us let us know a bit uh, a bit of law like some of the developers are from i think both of them uh both of the 3d artists are from north carolina one of them is uh anyway but if you're from north carolina and you uh, and you want to uh, um fill us in on maybe some law or some landmarks or things that you think uh should be in the game since it is uh, Western North Carolina, uh, let me know in the comments or if you've got any ideas in general about the map or any questions, jump in the comments and uh, let me know if you've got any suggestions and I'll answer any questions that I can. But uh, that's pretty much where we are. So uh, the next video you're going to see is uh, pretty much what I'm working on. So spoiler alert, I'm working on the NPCs right now. Um, I've just about done um, the the store menu. So there's three different types of um, NPC clerks. I'll show you on screen now. There's a general uh, store clerk, a gun store clerk, and a police armorer. Obviously, you can't rob the police armorer, but you're going to be able to rob uh, the store clerk and the gun store clerk. Um, I might even show you a little bit of a sneak peek of the animation on screen right now, but uh, the, the robbery system's actually also being developed, so that will be coming out in version 1.1, which will actually uh, come out a lot sooner than I expected. So expect that within the next um, week or so, maybe, maybe... Um, three weeks uh, but there's going to be a lot more videos coming out i'm going to show you a lot of sneak peeks um, of, of the systems that i'm making and or working on and that but anyway guys uh make sure you stay updated by hitting the subscribe button hit the like button to let the algorithm know to notify others about this project so if you um if you want to know more about this game uh hit the project uh documentation in in the description or go to uh the the community discord i post a lot of sneak peeks you know uh, announcement news uh videos and uh you can actually get the links for the devlogs the live streams and uh the random videos but anyway guys that's going to be it for this video hope you enjoyed we'll see you in the next one peace